Hey everybody, so sorry if you hear noises, just I just wanted to say sorry if you hear noises, but I'm going to show you how to make a fursuit tada. Yesterday I was trying to make the head, but I already kind of almost finished with the foam base, but I'm just going to explain it how I did it and then I'm going to move on. So here it is. It's going to be a gray husky. It's going to be my first ever husky suit. So I already did the mouth and the muzzle and stuff, but uh, I'm going to show you guys the colors of the fur. So you'll, wait, first, you'll need a hot glue gun, some fabric for inside the mouth for the lining, the nose too, um, some fabric for your tongue, um, what else? some paper, I don't have paper, this is just foam, uh, foam, this is one inch foam, so you could use whatever inch I think, um, some colors for the eyes, since it's a husky, it's husky, oops, huskies usually have two colored eyes, so I just wanted to make two colored eyes. This is like a blue, it's actually a teal, but it looks blue on camera, and this a brown. And then what you'll need next is some mesh. I don't have mesh because I ran out. <laughs> I'm just using this piece of a sock. It's sort of see-through. You can't, I can't really stretch it, but if you stretch it enough, it's see-through, so I'm just going to use that. And of course, you'll need your fur. Oh, wait, no. Scissors for foam. And I got new fur. I'm going to show you guys. So, it's this gray fur right here. I got it at Hobby Lobby. So, if you guys want it, you can order it from their, from their store. It's first as a husky. I never use this pretty gray fur, so I'm really excited. I got a yard. It costs about, like, 13 And under the foam, it's a white, which I use for crystal and some of my other suits. It's, like, a two-inch pile. This one's, like, a like an inch or an inch and a half. So let's get started. All I need to do, all right, I'm going to show you guys on how to make this. Oh, you also need tape. I don't have masking tape. I'm just using this duct tape. It's going to be a quick tutorial because each time I make videos, it just cuts all of a sudden. So what you'll need to measure the circumference of your head, the width and the length. This is from my chin all the way to my forehead. And then when you have that, you glue it together. You take a strip of foam and you glue it from across and a length. You just have to trim it a little bit on these sides. And then you take a square piece of foam, you fold it in half, and then you glue it onto the face. Oh, so you have to cut it too. And then you go and you glue two other pieces of foam on the sides to bulk it out a little bit. Then you make a strip of foam here, glue on the nose, a foam nose if you have a foam nose. And then for the bottom jaw, cut out your shape and um, uh, kind of hollow it out in the middle a little, a little bit. And then there, that's is where I'm technically left off. I'm trying to make a smile. I don't. I'm not really good at it, but this is kind of hard because I'm filling with my freaking iPad, so it's hard. I'm just gonna put this piece of foam here. Okay. Nope. Ah, frick. Okay. Sorry. I'm just. I'm kind of going quick, so because my friend was probably gonna go down in like a minute, but here is the head. Actually, you know what? let me actually put it right here. It's good. Yeah, that's definitely easier. Okay. So. Here's the head, right? Now we are going to take our paper and put it against the uh, wait, the uh, head um, and then trace out with like a marker or something like that. I don't think I, I actually don't think I have a marker, sadly. Yeah, I don't. Um, but I'll just, you know, try to do it, I guess. Okay, so take your paper and put it at the side of the head like this. And then trace out your cheek on how big you want your cheek. This is actually going to be having hair tough. So, yeah, that's just what I wanted to say about that. But, um, yeah. So, just take... Oh, actually, you know what? I do have a marker right here. So, let me show you. Take your paper. Is, this on, is it on camera? Yes, it is kind of on camera. Okay, so take your paper. And then kind of make a... Like a... Like a shape like... Like this, kind of like this, that goes all around up to the nose. And this will kind of make the smile, and then you'll have this shape, right? And then just make a little itty bitty smile like that. Well, you don't have to, uh, I'm not actually because that just made a, a big hole for um, crystals, so I'm just not, so that's that. Okay, now all you have to do is cut it out. I'm cutting it out right now just that you can't really see it. Because I'm using an iPad and I don't have like a stand yet or something like that that you need. But just doing a quick and I could do a quick tutorial and not let the camera die on me or something like that. Okay, and once you have your piece, 
you're going to, wait a minute. I actually think I have a little bit of a stand that I usually normally do. It's this weird blue thing, so I'm just, yeah, that is, is that better for y'all? Hopefully it is. No, oh, I'll do that. Um, now take your foam. I have this piece of foam. I don't like wasting foam. So take your foam and take your pattern and trace it two times onto your foam. This is, by the way, these are your cheeks. I think I said that before. <laughs> yeah, I have. Okay, these are your cheeks. Um, uh, you can make some cheek fluff if you want to. Make some like cheek fluffs or something like that. Uh, it's best not to waste that much material. So like try to use as much material as less material as you can. Cause then like for the since huskies are mostly kind of more white. Oh, for the for the gray fur I got one yard, and for the white fur I got I think two yards. I don't necessarily remember. But once you have it, you're just gonna cut them out. This is just gonna make the face a little bit bulkier. Uh, I don't know how to make cheek fluff. I'm sorry. Um, I, I yeah, I'm, I do finally know how to make hair fluff. So I'm thinking of making like white, since uh, the husky is going to be gray with white markings. Oh, this is gonna be my first ever two-toned head, and you know, two-toned stuff like that. And my first ever two-toned husky tail. So that's what I'm excited about. So let's just cut one piece for now, like this. And then this side, you could just choose wherever you go it. And then it's just gonna go right here. Okay, right here. See, like that. Now take it and take your glue gun, hot glue gun, and glue all over it. I just like plugged it in, so. Um, all these stuff you could get at Walmart. These, even the foam, it's like six dollars for foam. It's not that much, but if you, you could also get it from their store, I believe too. Um, except for the gray fur I didn't get at Walmart. Now take it, put hot glue in the back, and glue it onto your head, just like this. And hold it on there with some pressure in order for it to actually stick well. I try to make smaller heads now because it's more normal to have smaller heads. There's like music in the background, so sorry if you hear it. Um, I don't really have a good room yet. I mean, I'm thinking this room, but people usually go down and stuff. So, yeah. So, I think it's not even dried yet, but oh well. So, once you have it kind of dried or actually dry, trim it down to length. It's actually best if I, if I just, like, trimmed it regularly, like, it was like that. But all you have to do is trim it. I'm kind of doing it far away from me, so... Sorry if it just goes like out of focus or something, but I don't really trim that good. Um, so I'm sorry, but I don't really know how to do time lapse either or edit really good. I only know how to put music in, but I'm gonna learn how to cut videos soon and stuff like that. So thank you all for like 11 subscribers. Um, I know that's not that much, but like still. Okay, I thought my dog was coming down. Um, okay, so let's see, it's, there's a cheek, but we're going to add another piece. <laughs> yes, we're going to add another piece. Now, this one you don't have to necessarily, like, make it big at all. This one's just to bulk out the cheek piece a little bit. So, like, a little circle. I just estimated it. It's going to go, like, right there. It's just making the cheek piece, and this time I'm just going to cut it like this. It's probably best if I do that because it's easier... For me, this one has to be a lot thinner though. That's just the problem. So I can't make my videos extremely long, like at least like 10 minutes or, or like um, 15 because it will like shut off. <laughs> so that's why I'm kind of hurrying and talking fast. I'm sorry if I'm talking too fast, but there you go. Got your piece. Take your hot glue gun. And take put glue all over it. I actually try to add a thin layer if I can, because then it dries quicker. There you go, thin layer. Then you just carefully add it on top. Don't worry, we will trim it into more size later. It will trim in like in 20 seconds, so it's fine. It's fine. It's alright. Okay.
So literally, I could just like glue it on and it's fine. <laughs> so there you go, you have your cheek piece. Now we could trim it more into length because obviously I didn't know like when it was gonna happen. So I can't believe like I literally just made two videos and I'm already making freaking fursuit tutorials. But this is probably possibly gonna be like a mini partial or a partial with arm sleeves, depends. If I have enough fur, but it, the most important is to get like the paws or or like head and mostly head because that's what people mostly look at. But voila, there uh, we have one cheek completed. Now we could do the other cheek. So like I said, just do the same for the other. Sorry if it's a big laggy. Uh, usually when I'm recording, uh, it doesn't get laggy. But when obviously when I have to the, do the footage, it gets laggy, so. Ooh. That. And like I said, I'm going to trim it down like this first because it's, like I said, it's easier. I didn't know it was going to be so hard to do the other, but. Uh, it's alright, hopefully. So after I do this cheek, I'm going to have to end the video. I'm so sorry because I have to make quick videos. I mean, I think I could also like add one ear. I don't have to show you guys how to do the ear because this is going to be a part series kind of thing. Uh, a, B, it depends on the footage. So just put, oh, uh, you can't even, I don't think you could see me. So just add, I have to make one more commission after this, but not yet, like after this stupid co pandemic goes away. But uh, because my friend, I made a new friend here and she wants a fursuit head. Like a gray wolf, so like I'm gonna have to use that gray fur. It's amazing. I'm gonna have to ask her if that gray fur is great, but she's gonna get all the materials, not me. Cause uh, she like literally lives right in the back of us, so I could talk to her anytime I want. But voila, looks like one cheek is bigger than the other. Cause yes, it is. Okay, now we can finally, you know, cut out the other cheek. Oh, it's 12 minutes already. It's like a, like, a, like a time lapse or something. I'm trying to hurry up. Guys, I'm trying to hurry up. Um, but soon I will make time lapse and stuff. And like add music to the background and stuff. I don't know how to add music, just I don't know how to do it in the background. Okay. Um, I think it's a little bit too big. Yeah, a little bit more thinner. Because the top layer has to be thinner, but... Sorry if the video just cuts all of a sudden. It's because, like I said, my, my iPad is really old. It's like six years old, and like it's just really old, so. Sorry for the awkwardness. Okay, cheek, add cheek. Okay, ta-da, hot glue, attach it onto cheek. Success. There you go. Attached it. Um, there you go. Attached it. You don't I don't really trim foam that well because the when I glue or when I sew the fur, it's like already like good, so I mean that doesn't really make sense, but like oh well. I'm a YouTuber, so I'm a really I'm not that good yet. I mean my family thinks I'm good, but like I don't know. I don't know about that. Okay, there. We made the cheeks. Uh, it's 13 minutes. It's about to be 14. Okay, I think I can make an, an ear or two. So now once you have your cheeks, it should look nice and cute. Um, I'll probably make, like, part two. Like, a little bit, so. And, like, literally, like, after I finish a video, because my video's already quick, so. That's just what I'm going to say. Thanks for watching. It's about to be minutes. But don't worry. I'll make a video right after this one. So after you finish this one, you can watch that one. I'm about to make it, so just wait. So there's one part of making the head. Looks cute. Um, so it looks pretty good. Turning out good. Next, we will um, make the... No, actually, we will make the brows. This is where you could add follow me eyes or whatever eyes you want. So thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment, share. Or whatever you want, I don't really care. Uh, but <laughs> yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.